Did you know that 95% of website visitors leave without purchasing anything? I know that statistic can be a bit discouraging considering how hard us online business owners work towards marketing our products and driving traffic to our website, but the good news is there are solutions. Solutions that are gonna help you increase your website conversion rates and ultimately make you more money. Solutions such as lead capture, exit offers, upsells and cross-sells, Facebook Messenger leads, countdown timers, push notifications, personalized promotions, gamification, and more. If you're not implementing these promotions on your website, then you're simply not gonna be experiencing the conversion rates that you could be. Now, we've got Black Friday and Cyber Monday coming up. These are two of the largest shopping events, and it's gonna be unlike any previous year simply because of the way consumer spending has shifted from brick and mortar to online shopping. And so if you wanna take advantage of this, I'm gonna share with you how you can create a promotional offer on your website uh, without the need for a developer. You can do it yourself with the drag and drop, very easy um, to use platform. And you can have your first promotion live in under three minutes. Just Uno is one of the top sales and conversion apps on Shopify, and they are a Shopify Plus partner. The average revenue lift for their users is 135%. They integrate with all major e-commerce platforms, Shopify, BigCommerce, WordPress, Magento, etc. And they have been one of the top rated apps for a very, very long time with thousands of reviews. So I'm gonna introduce you to someone who's gonna share with you how you can use Just Uno to create some of the highest converting promotions for Black Friday, Cyber Monday, again, so that you can take advantage of this shopping event. Hey everyone, I'm here with Rob Hammett from Just Uno, and he's gonna be sharing with you how you can build high converting website experiences using Just Uno. So Rob, thank you for being here today. Do you mind sharing with us what does Just Uno have to offer for our audience? Thanks, Tatiana. Yeah, uh, so Just Uno is meant to be a complete on-site conversion app uh, for your Shopify or other stores. And you can do things like run, as you mentioned, various on-site experiences, whether that be lead capture, targeted on-site banners, uh, personalized messaging for users on your site, upsells and cross-sells, uh, any, any kind of on-site marketing um, need. Mm -hmm. All right, so today we're gonna talk about a more or less complete Black Friday, Cyber Monday uh, strategy uh, and something to get you going for the holidays. So uh, what I think is important is that right now you should be capturing as many leads going into the holidays as possible, and especially this year, um, you know, being a little bit different than other years we've experienced. But getting to the um, the nuts and the bolts of what you should be doing and experiences you can run through just, you know, I'm gonna run you through three. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a something that we call like a welcome screen on Black Friday and Cyber Monday. And what this does is this follows a strategic line of, hey, show people what your deals are, your doorbuster deals, and then get out of the way, right? Let them know what it is and then get out of the way. And don't worry about capturing emails on Black Friday or Cyber Monday or anything like that. So to show you what this looks like in the beginning, this is a preview of uh, before I get into the nuts and the bolts. So we have a full page experience. It shows to everybody exactly one time. And then I might have a follow up banner that uh, follows people around and just lets them know that we have a countdown timer associated with it. So uh, this is the full page of the website. Yes, this would take up. This is when you upload a image in the background of the design canvas and just, you know, it's an absolute fit. So it's responsive to the um, web page or the browser. That's great. So people have one place to direct all of their attention. They can't miss it. Yeah, yeah, and there's a lot of different applications for full page uh, experiences, but this, I, I, I feel that Black Friday and Cyber Monday especially um, make it easy to, uh, you're, you know, it's a, it's, a, it's a better place to run those um, experiences. So let's look at the nuts and the bolts of how this is built. So what you're looking at right now is just, you know, it's design canvas. Um, it's very much like, I, I like to describe it as Canva and Illustrator made a baby. And so it, it's, it's a layer-based web editor. We can see all of our text layers here. And what I think is important to point out is that we have an out-of-the-box countdown timer plugin. So uh, we've literally built this out over years. We've added plenty of theme options to it. So you have a lot of things like from sleek sort of uh, banner style timer themes all the way to this kind of like marquee style. that's a little bit more, you know, opulent, if you will. And mm -hmm. components of this setup are very simple, right? I'm telling people that, hey, I'm gonna actually do this for a whole month in 2020 because, because of the times that we're in, because Amazon started Prime Day so uh, late in the year this year in mid-October that just finished. So we're gonna try and get as much business early in the holiday season as possible. So I might run my, my cyber week deal for the whole month. So I'm gonna call that out in my messaging. 
I'm going to tell people what my doorbuster deal is. 30% off site-wide, uh, no coupon codes needed. And so you'll see a lot of companies that do not require coupon codes for this discount, which is absolutely recommended because mm -hmm. you're creating less friction in the user experience. Yeah, I can echo that. Uh, with my business in the past, I would use coupon codes and we would we would lose so many people because if they would have issues with a coupon code, they would reach out to customer support. Customer support isn't going to get back to them straight away. And then they would potentially we would potentially lose that sale. So I agree. I think that it's better to just for big sales like this, just forget the coupon codes. Literally anything you can, I think it kind of goes uh, for a lot of applications with your business is that you want to reduce friction with the customers, right? So if they don't need that extra coupon code to remember or hang on to, then don't don't uh, put it in front of them. Got it. Uh, this the rest of these components pretty straightforward. This is a close button, right? This doesn't actually link anywhere. It just closes the experience so that they can get to shopping. And this works especially well if you've directed them or if they click through an ad to a very specific product page or a collections page, then this just closes that uh, and allows them to go back to the page that they were meant to be on. And a note about uh, scheduling this. One thing you can do with Justin is you can actually schedule these to start and stop. So it acts as a way for you to get, you could be building these right now and scheduling them for your, when you wanna run these. So it doesn't have to be a whole month, but if you're running it for a week, you can schedule that right now, publish it, and that's the last thing that you have to do with the Justin experience. Perfect, so you don't have to do it last minute or stay up until 12 to start putting out this banner. But the beauty about Just Juno is that you can do this all yourself. You don't need a developer. It's easy to just drag and drop, create any kind of promotion, any kind of banner, any anything like this, um, and it can be done in under three minutes. Right. Yeah. So this and this has no integration requirements at all or anything like that. So you design this. We have uh, pre-built promotions as well that are very out of the box, done by professional a professional design team in house that you could literally launch, customize your deal, and make sure that you schedule it and everything. And the rules are already built in. Um, the rules look like actually. It's pretty, a pretty good segue to the next page here, which is our rules. And these are already built out with our pre-built promotions. So you can see very straightforward here. I'm showing this one time per visitor with no other conditions. Now for certain, uh, like you'll see some of our use cases in a minute, uh, some of those use cases do inherently have multiple conditions and just, you know, is well known in the market for providing one of the most sophisticated targeting engines out there for on-site marketing. So you have in virtually endless options. If you want to target someone who has been on six pages all time, in your site and after multiple visits and has never made a purchase, you could target them with a specific message and it's all very easy to create. But for this, for the purposes of this campaign, what we'll do is we'll just show it one time and then we're never going to show it again because we don't want to be showing that every single time that they uh, come to the website. Mm -hmm. So moving on to another uh, use case is we want to target low hanging fruit and you will have people that come to your site that add items to their cart and call them wish listers. They're people that add items to the cart to to reserve as sort of, you know, remembering for them that these are the gifts that I want is what I want to send to somebody else. These are the gifts that I want to buy for other people. So we call those wish listers. And they're very akin to cart abandoners, right? Because they will leave items in their cart. And that is low hanging fruit when you have holiday shoppers, especially, especially during this time of the year, especially when you're running site-wide discounts, it's important to know where that low hanging fruit is. So um, what we've done is another example of reducing friction for those people. And I've created an exit offer that's not only for people who exit the site, but it's also for people who return to the site with items left in their cart. So I want to make sure I talk to those people every single time they come into the store. It's like, it's like if you had a brick and mortar store and your sales associate happened to know every time someone walked in that left something on hold. And every time they walk in, you know, how are you, how are you greeting them? How are you speaking to them to let them know that, Hey, maybe this item's a bestseller. This is the last one we have left or, you know, any kind of scarcity selling and pushing them closer to making the purchase. So, mm -hmm. so these are, so this is great for people who are more likely to abandon cart, um, who just like to wish list things, but by sharing with them this special discount, it mm -hmm. might just be compelling enough for them to actually go ahead and make that purchase. Yeah. And this is another great, uh, strategic, uh, implementation for early holiday season um, and to make sure that you know fulfillment and logistics and everything and you're getting gift orders out as early as possible and maybe this is happening prior to your doorbuster sales but people are adding to the cart and they're leaving and they're coming back and everything this is really a great thing to use actually year round I think and so the the most important component I think on this is the scarcity selling and sort of having this reserved discount on hand for those people because also those people are most likely a discount affinity purchasers. So you're gonna get them to purchase with a discount and they're not gonna purchase without one. So um, might as well just put one in front of them. So I wanna show off the rules real quick just because I, you know, I was talking about all the various conditions you can do. And so I wanna show you that this is again showing once per visitor. 
I want to make sure I'm targeting people that have never made a purchase before because we'll keep them in their own segment, right? Mm -hmm. They'll be in some email drip flows and we'll, we'll get them other ways. But what I'm saying is they haven't made a purchase and their session or past seven day car total is greater than zero. And either they're leaving or they're the, returning to the site for the at least the second time. So this is an example of the sophistication that you can build with these, con these categories of conditions. And I will also segue that into our third use case, which is a dynamic free shipping threshold banner. This is really great for lifting AOV um, and sort of gamifying that experience in a way. Mm -hmm. So you'll notice I have an international and a domestic. I'm just gonna show you guys the uh, domestic one for the US and you can, you'll understand what I'm talking about with the international one, how easy that is to build out. But what this looks like in our canvas is a banner. So I've created a banner, very easy to do. We have pre-builds for all of those things as well. And uh, I have basically four layers. I have a close button and three text layers. And so what you're looking at here is simply the Shopify cart total variable. This exists for all Shopify, or I should say most Shopify stores, unless they're customized, but any out of the box themes for Shopify are going to contain this uh, curly bracket cart underscore total uh, close bracket variable. And so what you do, and we have support documentation about this as well, so we can walk you through it step by step, but my discount threshold for America is $50. So I'm gonna use that minus, I'm gonna create this little formula within these curly brackets to run a dynamic cart total you know, achiever basically. So if I have $22 in my cart, this is gonna say, ho, 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 you're only $28 away from free shipping. So this dynamically produces for each of the users on your site. Yeah, this, this definitely works. I was shopping the other day online and uh, I had the same thing pop up and it said I was only, I think $8 away from free shipping. So I was like, oh, I might as well buy another product. I ended up spending $15 on the product. So mm -hmm. it, it worked. Yeah, it, I mean, you'd be amazed too. Like you're like, I can get free. I can spend 18 more dollars because it's going to cost me $6 to ship it anyway. So it's like, man, I might as well spend, you know, 12 more net 12 and, and it works. And it's, it's very helpful because shipping is something that you need to call out on your website, especially during the holidays and most especially during 2020, because people are going to want to know everything about your shipping and returns, uh, especially during this season. So mm -hmm. great way to gamify it. Great. And let's look at the targeting rules real quick. And with this targeting setup, so I'm using our geolocation rules to say, I'm only showing this to people in the United States and uh, have not closed this banner. So I want to be respectful of people that already close it. So they haven't closed the banner. They are located in the US and their car total is greater than zero and less than 50. So what does this look like for my international group? They're not in the US. Their car total is less than 100 and greater than zero. And I changed that 50 back in the design canvas. I changed that formula to reflect 100 minus car total and then uh, versus $50 minus car total. So that's right. sort of how that's set up pretty easily uh, for our users. Um, and those are, those are three very powerful use cases. Uh, one is for your Black Friday and Cyber Monday deals uh, to showcase what they are on your site with countdown timers. The next targets very low hanging fruit with opportunities for them to convert at an increased discount, which can be run year round and especially pre-holidays. Uh, and uh, then our dynamic free shipping threshold counter, which is, is really great for lifting AOV. And it's especially great for those of you that run low margin stores. So if you have a lower gross margin on your products, it's a really effective way to just showcase when someone can get free shipping and do so without offering a direct discount. And let me just show you something as a bonus. This is how quickly you can create a Black Friday or Cyber Monday messaging banner within Just Enough. So we'll do our revolving text banner. We're going to add our brand new text ticker layer. So I'm going to set this up like this, squeeze this in, and have a nice sleek banner for myself. Let's go ahead and align that in the middle. So I'm going to go to this slide in from the right. I think I'd like this to slide down. Maybe scroll. You have a few different uh, options that you can do. So let's do slide down. So free shipping in order over dollars. Uh, next ticker, 20% uh, off with any purchase over $20. And then 40% uh, off, off and a free gift with any purchase over $300. So some, some pretty generous things that I'm offering for my website. So you have a lot of options you can present up to, I think it's like eight messages. Um, so text direction is, I already selected up down. 
Um, delay timer, let's go ahead and slow this down quite a bit. And scroll speed, let's stop on hover. And let me go ahead, I'm gonna close, or I'm gonna close this down a little bit. There we go, let's center that. And I'll put in my favorite, or my recent favorite fonts, which is most definitely gonna be Poppins. Where's my Poppins font? Okay, That's so. That's a good font. Yeah, I love, it's definitely been a favorite of mine recently. So we, you can integrate with all the Google fonts with Just You Know. So we'll go ahead and select that. And that should have opened up Poppins for me here. Of course, this stuff, there we go. So, and then I will go with my font size being more like 24, nah, 18. And I'll have to extend this out a little bit more. So let's grab this and center that again. And we have our sliding scroll or our uh, text ticker banner. So um, so obviously I didn't get, <laughs> it has some text here. I didn't get a chance to totally finish it, but this is a great feature to take advantage of. You can, um, you can really go crazy with the design options as well. And it's just a good alternative. A lot of times these have to be custom coded. Mm -hmm. They're not necessarily offered as just an out of the box layer. So Justin is a really good place for you to uh, do these things out of the box if you'd like. Awesome. Yeah. Well, I learned a lot. There, Just Uno definitely has a lot of different promotions and different things that we can create um, to help increase your conversions. So thank you, Rob, for sharing all of this with us today. You're very welcome. I'm glad I could help out. So if you guys want to increase your conversion rates, reduce your abandoned carts, and capture more leads, then you can try Just Uno for free for 14 days, no credit card required. Just go to tatianajames.com slash justuno, or you can click the link in the description box below. You can also check out our YouTube channel, which I'll link below, where they have more details about Just Uno and tutorials there as well. If you guys have any questions, feel free to comment down below. And remember that these massive shopping events can significantly help you increase your revenue for the year, but you do have to optimize your website and optimize what you already have. You don't wanna be driving traffic there knowing that 95% of people are gonna leave. So optimize what you already have going on, and that's an easy way for you to pick the low-hanging fruit and make the most of these sales.